Hello, everybody, and welcome back to The Aftermath. Now, last episode, we were working on quests and stuff, I believe. We had completed doo -doo -doo, uh, the security and starting the Wi-Fi stuff so that we can activate access our computer from anywhere. Um, our power on the computer is starting to go down because... Apparently we weren't generating as much power as I thought we were with the other generator or with the other energy cube Either that or this thing just Actually, you know what? You know what it is? It's because I have this thing on here. Let's pull you off for now We don't need you on there. We're not getting Wi-Fi. So throw you in there. This will start going up now. Yep So that's cool. So We got that in here set up um, And it, and we've got the Wi-Fi started so Today, um, first thing we're going to do, as you can see, I have snowballs now. I have, I got enough water and I made some in um, the chemical synth synthesis machine. So I made some water and now we can, I made some snowballs out of water. There we go. So now we can make this delight meal once I get a couple more ingredients into my inventory, including toast. I think... That will be everything. We do need potatoes. We need that. That's what else we need. All right. I think we have everything for a delight meal. So we need fries. So let's make some fries. We need a smoothie. So let's make a smoothie. And then we need to make a hamburger. And then we need some cheese. That's right. We need cheese. So some cheese. And then that will give us a cheeseburger somewhere. It should. We have a hamburger. We have the cheese. Where is the cheeseburger? Ah, there it is. Cheeseburger. Come on, cheeseburger. Take that. And then we make a deluxe cheeseburger. Take that. And then we make a delight meal. Um, actually, I just in case... We have to actually craft it. We'll craft it over here just to be safe. So burger, fries, and smoothie. Delight meal. Done. And quest completed. I cost a hedron. Mine. And that also gives us a freezer, which is nice. So we can just plonk this down right there, I guess. And now we can go ahead and just throw food in here. Ooh, we got a load of uh, delight meals. Awesome. We can throw stuff in this freezer that has a chance of decaying, um, and it will no longer decay, which is awesome. So yeah, we got four more delight meals, and we got our icosahedron, which gives us five icosahedrons now. We may go ahead and uh, open those. I'm not completely sure, but we may. It may be, it may, it may be something we want to do. Um, but so we got the delight meal done. Awesome. That gives our first three uh, quests levels. 100% completed. Um, in the kitchen, we still need some more um, some more carbon nanofiber, which we will collect, which we get from diamonds. Um, so basically, anything that has diamonds in it will work for that. Or compressing a whole load of carbon, which we get from coal. So let's see what we have. Uh, we got 26 diamonds. Um, so how much? What do we get for carbon nanofiber if we just use diamonds? So we'll get three if we use just diamonds. If we use diamond blocks, come on, where's the diamond block? That's fireworks. Nope. Where's diamond blocks? We'll be in here somewhere. There it is. So if we use diamond blocks we can get 27. So three times nine is 27. So it doesn't matter either way. It just will um, drop the, um, uh, power, drop the amount of power it takes to make it. So we have three and a half stacks. Let's see if we can make this. So we're working on if you haven't noticed, we are working on finishing up as many quests as we can today. So we'll see what happens. So if I put one in there, we should. Yep, there's 27. One more. 
All right, we have enough. We have four whole stacks. So now if we come in here, one, two, three, four, there. There we go. Now I just shove these up in there. And a poly tool. Um, now I'm pretty sure this works. Just in case, you know what I want to do is I want to see if we can make it in a crafting bench. Because we have to make it. So if I can make it in the crafting bench instead, we cannot. All right. So, yep, manual detect. So we should just need to throw these in here. Grab that. We do not have enough power? Apparently, we do not have enough power to make this. That's weird. Um, hmm, we should. We have plenty stored. Do we not have enough in here? How do you make this? Where's my book? Give me my book back. Alright, so, poly tool. The poly, a task where the player needs specific items. These do not have to be handed in. Okay. Um, this poly tool looks incredibly useful since inventory slots are low, blah, blah, blah. The 64 carbon nanotyper. Just shift click with the poly tool, blah, blah, blah. All right. Recipe. Yeah. Oh, it needs 42,000 RF. And we have not that much stored. So, let's come over here. We'll grab um, this one. Do we have enough? Yeah, we got loads in here stored. So, let's take on take this uh, resonant energy cell over here. And we can just throw this right on top like so. That will give us all the power we need. So, we need 42,000, I believe. Is that right? Um, recipe. 42. So we need this to be full. All right, nope, there we go. We just needed it to be there. So we grab. We have our poly tool. Dun, dun, dun. So we can get a heart piece. We can get silver, um, cali cal calcium, or lead. So we don't, I don't think we need any of those. Um, calcium comes from, oh, we can just break down um, clinic oxide. Yeah, calcium's easy to get, so we don't need calcium. So we're going to take the heart piece, mine. And that completes Tier 4, Quest Line 4. Fantastic. So just like that, we now have four quest, area, quest, um, quest lines completed, which is awesome. Uh, we don't need that. That can go in there. We have a poly tool now, so if I hold this and I left shift... So we can put what? Help. Poly tool is a multi tool that can be upgraded with certain elements to give. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. We can use this. We can um, put certain things on that. I remember reading about that. Um, I don't remember what we can put on it, but I know that we can put stuff on it. I think like some of this stuff, maybe. Um, I know there was something. I was looking at something, and it was saying that we can put certain things on this, and it will give it certain properties. So that is cool. Um, I'll see about figuring that out later. We don't act no blah blah blah. blah. We don't really need it that much right now, um, because we have a good amount of inventory space. It'll be nice to have a tool that can do a whole lot of different things. But like I said, we don't really need it right now. So. I won't worry about that. But that's four quest lines completed. We still have yet to finish to get to seven. So what we have left is we have our chemical quests, which the reactor wasn't done when I checked it. Um, I'm hoping it will be most. It will be almost done, if not done, um, after the after we're done up here. But when we go down to check, but it may not be. Unfortunately, it's pretty an annoying. Um, so I've got this um, in here. I've been working on having this thing run um, when I can to try and get as much of this oil refined. And then we'll use that oil and we'll refine it even more in our refinery. And work our way to um, LPG and then turn LPG in for emeralds and then get lubricant. And our lubricant right now is at 36. 
So I'm thinking, let's see. Oh, it does say lubricant drum. So if I just pick you up and I say manual submit, it's not going to let me because it's not full is my assumption is that the drum needs to be full in order for it to work. And that is going to take forever. So I have a proposition for you guys. Um, and I, I want to get as much opinion from you guys as I can. So just put it in the comments or whatever. And just let me know what you guys think of this idea. Um, would you guys... What, what do you guys think if I spawned in a drum of lubricant? Just... I'll take what I have here. I will... Well... Maybe I won't. I don't know. I won't say that. Um, I want it... But what's your guys' opinion on me spawning in a drum of lubricant? Because... Now here's the thing. We can finish this, we can get speed upgrades, which we don't really need, but we can get to this next quest, see what that is. Um, excuse me. See what that next quest is, and see what we need for that. It's another drum of something, but if it's something other than lubricant, we might be able to get it easier. Um, and another thing is, I haven't had time, and I don't know about these chemicals, but they are, like, if I come here, this one, the only way to get it is a singularity, which I cannot make. Um, now, there might be something that we have to do to get one up in here, and we might be given one. If we are, awesome. If we're not, I have no idea. So, um, right now, we need, for this, we need... Lots of crystals, so I haven't made any of those. We can't do that quest right now. So basically, the only quest that I can do that is... Yeah, see, we can't even turn this one in. Um, the only quest that I can do without cheating or without a long period of time of me trying to get a load of stuff is the cyanite one, which we're going to complete... Um, I keep saying, I've been saying that for like the last four, three or four episodes that we're going to have it completed in the next one and we still don't have it completed and we're just going to come down here while I continue talking. Um, but so yes, that is a thing. Um, so my proposal to you guys is that I spawn in a drum of lubricant to see what is next on this quest. Um, now that's the only... Now there's that, and then there is um, the chemicals, which I don't want to spawn in, because I believe I don't know how to get them, and if there is an easier way, a way to get them from smashing stuff together in here, which I'm sure there is, I would l prefer to do that. Um... I'd like to try and figure out what chemicals we need to compress a lot of and figure that out, but I don't know if that is actually like obtainable or not um, without completing other stuff. So I want to know what you guys think about spawning in the drum of lubricant. So I don't really have much more to do this episode um, Besides maybe making some crystals. So we can go through some of the processes. Um, if you guys don't... Um, I'll probably just fiddle around a little bit more talking about how I set stuff up and what we um, can do to make stuff run better and maybe try and do some of that stuff for the rest of this episode. So if you guys want to stop the episode now, it will probably just be small random stuff of me doing. Um, and I'll be rambling off while that is all happening. Um... But if you guys want to stop now, I won't hold that against you. Um, just please let me know what you think about um, me spawning in a drum of lubricant. A drum of lube, if you will. But um, if I have people saying don't do it, then I won't do it. And I'll just get it the slow way. Um, but it's taking a while. And I don't have... Um, 
countless hours and days to just sit and let stuff work, unfortunately. I could um, just leave the game running, but I, I don't really like doing that on any Minecraft um, game, just letting it run. So, but I want to know what you guys think. So, if you guys think that it's okay for me to cheat in a drum of lubricant, um, if there's like a penalty or something I have to pay for it, like I have to throw something out or I have to get rid of something, then um, let me know what your ideas are and whether or not you think that it's a viable option or not. So, um, but that's going to be all that I say about that. We'll just, uh, do some harvesting and resource working stuff. So let's see. We want to fit. I want to finish grabbing these leaves so we can get more water because I'm running low. So I'll just harvest up all these trees. Plant a couple. Harvest up these two trees. Plant a couple more. So yeah, this is like remedial stuff that I've done in episodes past or um, just off camera to let things run or that I need so uh, we don't need any of these leaves so we can go ahead and throw them into these and then we will throw the saplings and the wood in there um, another thing is we want to get that get some lava buckets we want to get this refinery running some more so that we can get more of this stuff because if you guys don't want me to spawn in the lubricant or if whatever comes after it is something we need all these um, fuels, fossil fuels for, then I want to have plenty stored up. So if there's an, I really wish there was an easier way for this pneumatic craft stuff to run. I want to see something. At new... Alright, so... Uh, pneumatic craft. We have the advanced air compressor, the air cannon. Yeah, that looks like that's about it. We we could do a creative compressor, but that that's cheating again. And I don't really I I don't really want to cheat. But when it comes down to either cheating, I wonder if we could make it from the fluid compressor. Let's see, where did I put that fluid compressor? Um, I think we had an advanced one, didn't we? Um, yes, an advanced fluid compressor. Could this create other chemicals? What kind of stuff? What kind of stuff can we do in the fl advanced fluid compressor? Um, empty information. Uh, this machine is the tier two version to the fluid compressor, like its lesser resident brother it can generate compressed air using liquid fuel oh all usable fuels can be seen in the available fuels tab so what fuels can we use we can use lpg gasoline fire water rocket fuel kerosene diesel ethanol bio biomass Hutch oil, blazing pyrothium, um, and a whole bunch of molten stuff. Okay, that's cool. I should use this. So LPG will be the best, but we really want to use that for other things. Um, gasoline, compressor, um, heat. We don't want it to be able to overheat. Um, I'm going to look into this, guys. So I'm going to end this episode here. We are getting to around 20 minutes. Um, I'm going to end this episode here. Um, if you've stayed on for my little ramblings um, at the end, then kudos to you. Um, if not, I'm not going to hold it against anyone. But So um, please, again, let me know what you guys think about um, me spawning in a drum of lubricant. Um, if you don't want me to, I won't. If you think that it's good and that I can and should, then please let me know. And I will see what happens in the next one um, after this. So, um, thank you all so much for sticking with me through the last bit. And I hope to see you all in the next episode. Till then, guys. Bye-bye.